Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back once more to the glorious Ottoman domination of this Petri dish. The Petri dish with many other pathetic bacteria inhabiting it. And we're currently in the process of war with the Polynesian and Indian bacteria. With the potential for tensions arising with the other bacteria which are spreading their influence even further than what I'm comfortable with. with the Americans bordering our colonies and the Mongolians starting to spread a little bit too much, as well as the Inca, who are now heading to north towards my colony of Gyanzi. And the Polynesians are consistently being stupid and sending their workers right into my territory. What's, that, what's happening? The city-states are consistently in constantly in quarrels with each other, and that Siamese merchant is doing nothing. Nothing. It's just standing there. It's just standing there. Daddy. Enough of this. That's right. Get me some oil. Okay, how we do? Three more turns. All ships of the line. Aha. No. Stay there. You have the farm. You would prefer a trading post, but a city in a desert needs its food. It also needs its mines, and... Keep pummeling those damn workers. Kill them so they stop irritating me. Yeah, that's right. Have some rockets to your face that are so destructive they cause you to disappear completely. <laughs> no mercy! In fact, I should upgrade these guys, or should I, because, well... My power comes in my navy, except in cities like this, where I have to take them by land. But most Polynesian cities, including their capital, can be taken by sea. Shapilish the cat. What's this? A polyp? What? What's happening? Honestly, what are city states doing attacking each other? Hang on a minute. No. I don't know. It's just what about well, where's Mombasa? Oh, well, they're neighbouring each other, so that makes sense. I've just never seen city states actually outright attack each other like that. Now, I'm not going to build any more frigates because soon we'll have battleships. With battleships come so many delicious things. Zanzibar has declared war on the Inca. Aha! Uh -huh. More science with a library! And a university! Crank them out. Everybody will... Everybody wills an army that could... Yeah, about eight times as much science as we have in population. Glorious! And Should I build a mine? Because this city is not strong when it comes to production. But then again, the, the jungle provides science. Look at that, free science per jungle time. And that's mostly because of the trading posts, but... All of that science! No. Build a trading post. Trading post. Thing. Trading thing. And you know what? At this point as well, you're going to join the offensive, although I sh probably would be better to attack Polynesian cities here, I'm not sure. And again, hitting them here would, would also leave us them vulnerable to flanking attack by the Indians. So I think I'll take out their northern colonies first and just burn them to the ground, since they don't have anything that I need. I already have whales and gold and marble. <laughs> I've nearly everything. So they've made that. Build another trading post in the jungle. We can have farms and cattle. Oh geez, we're boarding with the Indians. Now there's Zanzibar. I'm sure. Good day. Greetings, Washington. I come Go seeking, ahead. never mind, I've got nothing to trade you, so kindly piss off. Sweden! In the gleam and flows in Norse Sweden. Ah. Oh. 
Nothing. Yeah, call Surely I have spares of those. Genghis, I've traded with you many times. I am Bernal. And you have no. nothing spare. Well, I have nothing spare. Uh, Siam. So what about you? Indeed, don't rub. Nope. Well, I can spare luxury boosts because I've got so much happiness. But this happiness is also giving us over a hundred science. So I'm not gonna. I'm gonna keep happiness to a maximum. And I'm actually going to get even more happiness from the theatres that I'm building. And I asked you to construct a damn well. Oh wait, you can be shot at by that city. Uh, oops. This. Oh, those Americans. Los Angeles. Come on, Washington. You're spreading as much as the Polynesians are, and the Inca, and me. The only one that isn't spreading like a plague now is the Swedish and the Siamese. And may well the Danish haven't really spread outside of their original borders that much. I think. They're still sending workers into my territory, eh? Just sell the damn guard just sell them if you don't want them. What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? Knights, and the city wasn't even able to kill them, but the privateer was. Good kill, good kill. There's some skiing infantry on a coal deposit, skiing on coal. That won't work too well, but yes, another golden age has dawned, and we now have a powerful ironclad. Ah, oh, yeah. 45 strength compared to a private here. So, I'm afraid we no longer require the services of that private here. And I'm going to kill these guys because I can. I don't like the way they're looking at me. Kindly die. Oh, good shot, good shot. Nicely done. Continue the offensive, but I'm not going to. Privateer, I'm afraid your time has passed. I have an ironclad now. So your services are no longer required. Kindly head back so you can be decommissioned. Trading post. Your production is less than stellar. I have quite a few mines, but not enough. Crank out more production. Bomb. This place is going to be a powerhouse when it comes to food with all, all this wheat. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Stadium. Next turn. One more turn, one more turn. And then... Build an... How come they're not actually shooting at them? Do they not consider workers to be a threat? I suppose that make I'll forget what I said about the Siamese not spreading. They've set up a settler there. Bordering a city-state and the Americans. Not the wisest idea, because aside from the gems, there's not much there. Don't you already have gems? I guess not. Well, <laughs> you're a bit behind, Genghis. Were you the one that stole military site? Uh, whatever it was for me. I don't know. He must have been the one that stole tech for me, because he, if he's that far behind. Because I'm almost atomic. Oh, crap. Washington ha is spreading just as much as the Polynesians, and if he declares war on me, I'm going to be attacked from both ends. Which won't... Oh, crap. He's got five bombers stationed. Whoa. Hanoi as... Ah. Screw you, Hanoi. You're really annoying me right now. <laughs> They've got five bombers there. So they could well be staging for an attack on me. Could I maybe bribe someone else into declaring war on them to get them to change their plans? 
I don't know. Yes! Come on, ships! Attention, all frigates! Oh gosh, that's pricey. Istanbul. Get a military base. Oh, atomic theory. We can go for nukes. We don't even have dynamite from the industrial era. We're a bit behind. I want nukes though. Because then we can, then we'll, if we find uranium. But might as well just finish off the industrial era. Because railroad. Can we build Duschwinstein? I think we can. There's a city down here. Yeah, within two. T production there is less than Stella. It only has four citizens, and they need to work food as well as production. Hmm. Either way, it's time for. Where, where are my best ships? This guy is a bit behind. So I'm gonna. Now you see these. This is the Ottoman Navy, people. Oh, I can upgrade everyone. Almost. No, I, that's, that's everyone. Except for the ironclad. <laughs> Privateer, I apologize, but you're out of date. We've got an ironclad. Well, not exactly out of date. It's just ironclads are better. We're going to make our move on the Polynesian cities now because we can attack from out of range. Or, or we've, we've got better range than them. Genghis, would you like to declare war Sand on battle. Washington? You? No? Nothing? Uh, what about the Inca? Would you like to declare... Oh wait, the Danish. Surely they'd be willing, because they've had problems with Washington in the past. He'll die. He'll die to you too. Let's hear it. No. Here's hoping that Washington changes his plans some other way. I'd rather not be attacked by all those bombers. It's those riflemen. They're out of date. I'll move them there. Next turn. Mind? What do you want? Get that well finished. Would they... Would India at least be interested in a peace agreement? Or were they in cohorts with each other and therefore... Yeah. They probably can't make peace until another set of turns because of a deal they made. No matter though, I almost I don't want peace with the Polynesians because I want to put this navy to use. That puny little city up there is going to be dis this a little caravel against industrial aero boats. Which was rather effective. <laughs> Washington, I'm begging you, please don't start anything yet. I have business to settle with the Polynesians. Whoa! I think their alliance with each other has deteriorated somewhat. Oi! Leave my city states alone! Oh crap, they have battleships as well. Oh no! So much for that tech advantage. But as long as they don't have battleships in their cities, then we'll be good to go. Because battleships have three range, cities have two. If I remember correctly. Yeah, I'm sure that's the case. <laughs> that ironclad won't last long. Oh, it's been captured! Good going, Prague! Yeah, the city-states are doing well for themselves. 
Alright, Rifleman, I'm not going to upgrade you. Not unless I have an actual use for you. Okay. Sorry, Millie, I'm going to have to go solo for a bit. I keep an eye out for any more ships. Battleships. <laughs> oh, so glorious. I can't wait to upgrade them to missile cruisers. Because then they'll be the most badass vessels in existence. Private here. You're out. Oh, you can still move. No, you can't. They should actually be able to move into range next turn. Ooh. Have I got a religious building in here? No. That's the profit that we can build. Which I'm not going to do. When did they That's six turns. How much is it going to cost? 70. Do it. Got plenty of income. I got money to burn, so I'm going to burn it. I still don't have any of these national wonders yet. This is the longest I've ever gone, I think, without building Oxford University. But I think leaving it this long would actually be a good thing, because then you can instantly get a very high-level tech. And how about we crank out another battleship? Yeah. Improve on the... Oh. Again, Polynesia. As I said before, just sell your workers. And this place... Ooh, research lab. Do it. Gonna take a while, but, the, but it gives a 50% science boost. And in a larger city, that's a nice boost. Crank out university as well, will ya? Is the workboat still on its way there? Or was it destroyed by Polynesia? Probably because I don't see it anywhere. I'm going to give it a couple more turns. Two more turns. I'm just going to have to do that two more times. Come on. Oh, the no you don't. I don't... You, gang, they said you were plotting against me. So I'm not opening my borders to you. No thank you. Unless you happen to sweeten the deal. Because I do know that if you have open borders with someone, but then you declare war on them, all of your troops that are in their borders instantly get kicked out to the nearest available land tile. Uh, Polynesia. You're just considering your work as expendable. And your troops. You're sending them in to attack that city alone. And all they have to support them is workers. We're providing moral support by building nice things behind you. Although in essence we're actually building walls behind you so you can't retreat from the battle. <laughs> Genius. As soon as men decide. <laughs> like it's done, oh might. We have another head down there. Oh look at all that food. Six food from these tiles. Oh workshop actually so we can build the Railroad, perhaps. Because then we can get destroyers. And ballistics. And though, and then I'll get atomic theory. Because we need that to get... I think we need it to get rocketry or is that radar? We're on our way. Let's destroy these damn bleeding annoying workers and sound. What's this? Privateer? Don't make me laugh. Okay. Deploy the battleships first. They should be able to attack from there, but they need... Yeah, they need a sight line. Unless that hill is in the way. If it is, I'm going to be very annoyed. Ships, deploy. I think you're going to need to move. Ah, good, we can see it now. 